uh, is more like a government one, like Turkana uh, wind power. But Mr. Speaker, all these power producers, Savo Power, Rabai Power, Immentity Hydro, Thika Power, Gikaria, Gulf Power, name it, I, I Africa, Mumia to a company. Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, uh, because this is a matter of public interest, this committee I have done a good job. But Mr. Speaker, government and that more so the Ministry of Energy have refused to answer two important questions. And Mr. Speaker, under Article 117 on the powers and privilege given to Parliament and its committees, and even the leader of majority and the leader of minority, if you read 117, and Article 35 of the Constitution on access to information and the Powers and Privilege Act. Mr. Speaker, this committee, for the first time, have been denied two important fun, uh, uh, questions. One, the directors and the shareholders of, the, of these 18 independent power producers. And Mr. Speaker, I want to confirm that these directors and shareholders are big people some of them in government and some of them in the energy sector. Two, Mr. Speaker, I have asked for the contractual obligation that they have entered with the, with the KPLC. The, 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 the chair has been denied the last three months. That, and in fact, the answer, Mr. Speaker, he says that I should go to a court of law and get an order as a member for Garissa Township so that those answers can be availed to me. Mr. Speaker, before you give direction, I want to say it without fear of contradiction that in 2019, so that they can hear us, KPLC spent 15 times more to buy power from the independent power producers even compared to Kengen, which is a government entity. The Speaker, in that period, Kenjen, Kenjen was selling power to KPLC at 4.6 cent to the kilowatt hour. Mr. Speaker, I want to give you four companies out of these 19. Mr. Speaker, Kenjen sells to KPLC at four shilling, 4.6 of a cent per kilo per hour. Mr. Speaker, I'll give you four companies among these 19. Trump Power Generating Company, whose directors have been denied, sold to KPLC at 69.2 kilowatt hour. 15 times more expensive. Mr. Speaker, Gulf, Iba Africa, Power Tech Solutions, Salvo Power, sold to KPLC at 26.3, 16.9, 14.7, and 11.77, respectively, per kilowatt hour. So these independent power producers, Mr. Speaker, are the ones who are making Kenyans pay for power. And they are owned by people who mint billions. Mr. Speaker, I'll even give you an, a scenario. In, according to KPLC, Power, electricity power generating agreement they have signed with these companies in 2018, KPLC spent 64 billion to buy 10.79 billion kilowatt per hour from these companies and Kenjen. Kenjen produced 10, uh, about 60% of that. These other companies took away close to 29 billion, and it's in the document. 29 billion. But Mr. Speaker, one thing that Kenyans don't know, and I want the Minister of Energy to tell me, under this power, power purchase agreement that we have in this country, there is a component called capacity charges. And the member for GEM, you know, started from a very lower rank in KPLC. You know, those who climbed the, 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 the poles until he became a big man. So he understands what I'm talking about. There's something called component of capacity charges, where KPLC pays the independent power producers even when they are not generating. These power producers, even if they don't generate, 
They don't sell to KPLC. They earn billions of shillings in the name of capacity charges. These charges are transferred to the ordinary bills of the Kenyan citizens.